Oklahoma Central High School. My name is Kevin Mabry and this is Tribe TV. For school news today, Campus Life will be hosting breakfast every Friday morning at 7 a.m. in the library. All students are welcome to come and eat donuts and spend time with their peers. Quiz Bowl practice for this week will be today after school until 3.15 in Mrs. Hee's room. If you have not yet written down your name, grade, and shirt size, please get that information to her on Thursday. Music. Machine Gun Kelly pulled up to the Breakfast Club on Thursday morning for an in-depth conversation to about his entertaining beef with Eminem. MGK made it clear he believes M's kill shot was a weak, weak response and doesn't even warrant the reply he had ready to unleash on Slim Shady. Gaming. Bethesda, first new IP in 25 years, Starfield is so wrapped up in a mystique and profundity right now that we're not even sure if it will be releasing on this generation of console hardware. Here's what we do know. It's set in an open world RPG set in space, and Bethesda was, has been working on it for years. Sorry, but that's about it for now, but at least the studio was kind enough to confirm its ex existence after so many whispers amongst the industry. Given Bethesda pedigree, Starfield is now one of the most promising titles of the future. Movies. MGM and Orion announced the beginning of the production of their reboot of horror classics Child's Play and also confirmed the casting of Aubrey Plaza and Brian Terry Henry in lead roles. Released in 1988, the original Child's Play first introduced the classic horror's character Chucky, a child self possessed by a spirit of a dead serial killer. The film became a sleeper hit with $44 million at the box office and spawned an entire series of sequels and continuing right up to 2017's Cold Chucky. Local news. The Marion Housing Authority voted to sell a building on the corner of 38th and Washington Streets in the meeting Thursday. World well, news. President Trump has recommended building a wall across the Sahara to solve Europe's migrant crisis. Spain's foreign minister says the comments came during a visit Mr. World made to uh, made the U.S. at the end of June. Since January of this year, 35,000 migrants arrived in Spain, the highest number received by any EU country. Sports. MHS Volleyball won against Elwood. Tennis team is now CIC champions. Weather. Today's weather is going to have a slight overcast as well as a temperature of 83, 83 degrees Fahrenheit with a humidity level of 64%. For lunch tomorrow, we are having mini corn dogs, potato rounds, cauliflower, and mandarin, mandarin oranges. Have a great day, MHS.